Hello everyone, and I've got a major big bundle here of diamond paintings, it seems. I have not opened it to look in, and the store, I will post it when we open them up in the next part, so stick with me, and we'll open this up. May not get to all of them, but we'll get to most of them. Might be two videos, because this is a lot, so <laughs> stick with me. We'll be right back. Wow, I <laughs> time sensitive material it says on here. Okay. Um, there's a lot in here. And I'm excited to see what it is what it is. I forget all the time what and all I have how I have ordered and what and all is supposed to be coming to me because some things take a month and some things takes a week and some things take two days or whatever. Just got back from that that wonderful um, beach vacation and <laughs> getting back in with the rhythm. We had got our pool. I've been I'm always struggling with that pool out there had to change the sand in it. Had to put new sand in it, take out the old, put new sand in it. With sand filters, it's like every three or four years. And it's, we were trying to eat by this year and get, you know, get by with it. But we went on vacation, even though I shocked it and put a lot of chlorine tablets to float around in the pool and made sure all, everything was good. Come back and that thing was green. <laughs> I mean green. Um, can't see the bottom, so I don't know if there's a body in it. Hope that, hopefully there's not. Because <laughs> I can't understand why it would turn green so quickly, even though I had I had been doing the, the shock and, the, and everything, the maintenance, every week, like clockwork. And for some reason, I just, I think the sand just pooed it out. It said, look. It's really hot this week, and I can't keep up. So, that's what we were doing out there today. So, you know, I might look, <laughs> you know, how that goes. Hot. It's hot out there. And with my husband having the pacemaker put in, he can't hold, pick up big, heavy things. And I've had, I've developed this uh, thing in the back of my eye where uh, there's a gel layer that is peeling off as you get older it does that but within so many weeks like eight six to eight weeks if you bounce up and down or if you carry something heavy or if you strain or anything like that you can it can actually cause your retina to pull off with it so that's what creates uh floaters and things like that i'm digressing my goodness but you know i have to update you i know so anyways I, I'm not supposed to do that, but so we kind of helped each other <laughs> trying to get it done. We still had to do some heavy stuff. So, you know, sandbags, 50 pounds, that's, that's pretty heavy. So anyways, we got it done. And so we've ate supper and now I'm here to show you some of these wonderful diamond paintings. We're going to see... The um, company I'm going to put right here. I'm going to slide over and put it right here for you. This will be the company that this come from. And um, a lot of times these are not, these are new companies. And, or this may be one that I've just ordered from just because I like, like the, the paintings. So, if that's the case, it'll be right here for you to find these these actual pictures. See, when I do these videos, it's not off hand. It's in my head until I see them, and then I go back and look at my orders and stuff and find out which <laughs> um, store I used because there's so many out there. There are so many out there now. There, I think one company may have 15 different different stores. You know, or one one company will have 15 different warehouses. 
I don't know how it goes, but that's what it seems like. But anyways, let's get right to it. I have one, two, three. I've already got that one. Four, five, six, seven. Now I have a duplicate one in here, so I hope it ain't something I ordered and just out my mind. Because this one was the one I was trying to find that time. If you remember, I can tell by the way it looks right here that it must be that seahorse that I was looking for. <laughs> right off the bat. All right, anyways, let's put this one back. I'll show it to you later. But I'm gonna put this one right here because that, that is a duplicate one. I put it back. It might even be bigger than the one that I had, that I have. So I may do a drawing or something or 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 some kind of if i can ever figure out how to do a live with this camera i may have to do it with my my phone or something my daughter's gonna have to we're gonna have to figure out how to get this camera over into the the computer on the wi-fi so just haven't had time to figure out something complicated like that you know how it goes okay so now we have two four six we have six so let's do three let's do three okay i'm gonna put just randomly put these aside right down here and we'll do three in this video we don't want it to be too long you know y'all get tired of me and it real quick so let's do the little one first okay this is going to be a 30 by 40 and let me find the edge how to open the thing <laughs> i don't have my glasses on and i'm going to be having my eyes checked soon probably next monday i think it's next monday um after my initial where they found the issue with my eye and um it's not due to diabetes or anything boy this thing's in there uh, i think i'm gonna have to just rip it off because i can't get the I can't get it to come out of the plastic sleeve. Yeah, see, I'm making hope. All right. I don't like that. I like to be able to have the sleeve to put it back in, you know, to, to store it. But I'm telling you what, this is a comedy show. It is. I'm trying to get this thing open. Y'all sit there and watch me and watch me struggle. And you're probably thinking that. Mims is at it again. Mims is having a hard time. I feel so sorry for her. I better pray. Yeah, get down and pray. And I'm not making fun of no prayers. And let me tell you something. I cherish your prayers. I'm telling you. I ask the Lord, please, bless each and every person that even thinks the sweetest thing about me or kindness or anything or that gets inspired about me, bless them, bless them with everything you got, Lord, I tell you, with, with protection and safety. Okay, here we go. Let's see what this one is. Oh, I know what these are. I have a friend in, on Facebook that has a store that, you know, that has my uh, carousel horse as a diamond painting that you can pick up at her store it is a special drill full drill special drill um at her store and she also sells wonderful sparkler diamonds that you can actually use in your pictures in your diamond paintings instead of what comes with them and you'll understand it in a minute i'm gonna these pictures I selected just to have so I can try out her glow-in-the-dark diamonds and I'm going to substitute those 
for the ones in this where the light and the glowy stuff is supposed to be. So it will make sense once you see it. This is an illuminated like ghost butterfly. It's just really cool. I love the way this looks, but honey, it's cute now. But what do you think when I use glow in the dark diamonds in the place of where all the pretty glowy stuff is supposed to be? So if you look at it up close, you can see how nice it's the, it may be a moth because you know, moths comes out at night and it looks like it's nighttime. And there are some beautiful moths out there or millers. We're in the South. We say millers. We call them millers. Instead, and it's a moth. That's what we mean. A miller is a moth in the South. So if you hear someone say, oh, look, there's a miller on my door. Or, or there's a miller. Look at all the millers flying around that light bulb outside or whatever. They mean moths. <laughs> so, um, yes, it is a 30 by 40. It has 24 colors in it. And I love the size of the key over here. It did come with the normal tray and a little square of wax and the diamonds. Let me check and make sure that um, the, the number eight, I mean the A601 is right here. You can see right here beside the size. That's the item number right here. And it is on the PAX A601 right there. As you can see, I do have a little shadow right there. I'm going to try to stay out of it. This is it. And if you notice, I don't know if you can tell if that sparkle... Let me, let me take the, this off the cover. Pour glue, clear cover, okay? It is sticky. We just have wrinkles that will press out. I don't really see any issue with the actual glue itself. And I don't know if you can tell, but if I can make it to where you can see the actual glitter. I'm going to move it slowly. Maybe you can see some of that glitter popping since it's a darker canvas, darker colors, you know, you might can see it right there. You might think I can see it on the camera. But anyways, there that goes. We're going to put that back on there. This one could probably be when I get, I'm going to order. See, I had to wait. I have to wait until I get it in before I order from my friend, di paint, di painting, let's say it's Diamond Painting with Sparklers on Facebook. She has a store, so um, I've got, I had to see what color this is. It's more of a, a cream off-white and all, but I can change this. I could change this. This is the letter I, the symbol letter I. And I can change every one of those out for another color if I wanted to change the color of this this uh, butterfly with those custom colors that you can get from her. And yeah, you, but you'd have to guess how many you need. And I always guess a little bit more than I think I need. I'll have a lot extra. And you can always use them for other things. So. And there's nothing wrong with this side of the canvas. It is still sticky on that side too. And I'm loving this glitter. I love looking at this glitter. And yes, you will cover it up with the with the um, drills, the diamonds, as you do it. I hope you can see that wonderful glitter on there. It's so pretty and sparkly. Let's see if I can get that up there at the top to really shine. 
you can see it. I hope it comes through for you. Maybe it being, you know, nighttime, it will come through. This is, whoops, whoops, see what I did wrong? This flipped over to the bad side, so you have to be very careful. The outside, the top side of this cover, for some reason, does not like that glue. And that glue does not like this. So when if you put if you take this thing all the way off and you put it on wrong, you're gonna have a pulling contest on this thing, and it may even pull jerk the glue off the canvas. So never ever ever take this all the way off. Only work in sections. Pull it back and keep it from flipping over like I did. And you don't want to pull off any glue. Okay, so we do have 24 colors and they are the alphabet. The symbols are at the alphabet. They do have the DMC numbers, the color number, three tens and number one, the black ones. 317 is number two, 371 is number three, and that's the order I usually go in. I usually go the order. I used to, when I first started, I would say, okay, which one has the most? And I would just do everything of the most. <laughs> and then I go to the next, and then, you know, it just, I go down, down the, I'll do like half the, half the side, and I'll go down this whole this whole thing or I got no sometimes I'll do this I'll do all the three tens on one side close that up go over here and do the three tens on this side okay so and then go to number two that's what I normally do okay sometimes I'll mix it up and forget how I do it and just <laughs> go for it and do whatever. Anyways, here are the diamonds that come with this one. We're looking for 24. Nope, there's no inventory sheet, but most little tiny 30 by 40s usually don't come with one. So if I wanted to kit this one up, which I probably would just keep them in this and not really go through the kitting up process. And because it's a small one, I would probably, uh, if I wanted to kit it up and put these in separate containers, I would want to uh, print this out on, a, on my printer. And I have a little sticker maker that I can push that, I can cut that out, put it through the sticker maker, and then cut each, each, the copy, I would cut each one of these things out and stick them to the uh, containers that I'd put these in. So, but I, it's so little on these little ones, I don't bother to do that unless I know I'm going to be going somewhere and taking it with me because I don't want to lose these. But I have taken them with them just like this and just had a pair of scissors and some tape so whenever I would cut it and I'd be done with like let's say I did all the three tens I would I would literally because I know I'd have some left over I would fold it over twice and then I would tape it so that way I would not lose any of them okay here is numbers 21 22 23 and 24 and you can see what colors they are they are round it looks like they're uh, really good quality. I don't see a lot of hitchhikers, other colors, any uh, mixes in there. Colors seem to be all the same shade and not a bunch of mixtures of the same shade, of different shades, of somewhat same shade. And I have seen that in some, <laughs> some of you probably seen that where you buy you buy one and and when it got there uh like let's, let's say this this um plum color or grape color would be variances of that color not all of them being the same color <laughs> they'd be very close but you could tell with their with your eye that it wouldn't be what it's supposed to be and there's the three tens the 
the uh, black and it looks pretty there's something right there in there but um, other than I don't see any a lot of trash in it there's the number two is a gray this is a moss color um, gray this is a moss color this is a, another um, a pretty it looks like a green based gray a regular gray an um, orangey light light orangey tan uh, well huh. I, I just whatever <laughs> I can't think tonight a gray and that's a tan co color um, another brown a dirty brown you know, you're probably getting the colors better than me. <laughs> Figuring it out better than me. A nice navy. Um, and this is more of a blue, uh, gray blue. You know, uh, just really fun. They're dark colors. Dark, earthy colors. Burgundy-like. Or wine. And you, you can just see all these wonderful earthy nighttime colors now there was a hitchhiker if you could see it that little one little dark one right in there you see that now one of them i worked on that one that i did the speed painting it actually had what was so crazy about it is it had several of the previous color in the pack with it which was really crazy of uh, the next pack. It's like they were planning for you to have missed some and <laughs> had it in there just right for you. So you could you would have some in there without having to go back and open the container, the previous container. <laughs> that was kind of weird. I had, I, you know, at the first of it, I was like, oh, they just had some hitchhikers. And then I realized it, everyone had some from the previous envelope. And I was like, okay, <laughs> this is different. So there you have it with the, the little uh, Miller moth. And we're going to try to get her to glow really pretty and all. And it's at nighttime, so it's going to be really neat. Really neat. I love it. Different really different okay we're gonna go into the one that is in one of these now i'll tell you what these do are y'all ever able to open these without without tearing it that's the challenge i know i got another i got another homework challenge for y'all go out and buy you some starburst fruit chews the square starburst fruit chews and I dare you to chew it and not swallow and chew it till it's gone without swallowing it down. That is the hardest thing to do because your body's like, oh, this is so good. This is so good. I'm just going to, oh, there it went. I had half a piece of candy still left. And I, I dare you. I dare you. I think I did it one time. Anyway, let's see what this is. And I hope it's nothing that won't turn out. It sort of looked a little mottled to me. Okay. Now, when I had it on the sideways, sideways, I couldn't really tell what it was. But now, I can tell what it is now. You can better on, on here. Now, if you were in person with me, you'd be like, it's all like Minecraft. Squares, pixelated. But look, this must be New York, because that looks like um, the bridge. Uh, I think that's the bridge in New York. And that must be Rockefeller Center. The ice rink, maybe? And that's the tree? I don't remember ordering this. Okay, 
But anyways, this is going to be another one that I'm going to try to find glow-in-the-dark diamonds to replace certain things like the, the Christmas lights and things. It's, it's an experiment. So, yeah. So, and just to let you see how pixelated it is, I'm going to put it up close to you. And I'm hoping it is focusing. And you really can tell on the people. But this one, I think, is more supposed to be abstract. Like an abstract painting. It looks better farther away. See? You don't really need to know who each person is, do you? You don't really. Whenever you're in town... If you were a visitor, or if you were someone that lived there, you would be like, you know, you know, I'm on my way somewhere, and I'm walking, and I'm looking, I'm looking at the tree, and I'm looking at everything. You really don't take in each and every individual. Sometimes people do. Some people are people watchers. Now, they put a big number up here for the item number. And it is on the pack of diamonds. This is a square, I do believe. Is it square or is it round? It's round, I'm sorry. For some reason, the, this color looks square. But it's not, it's round. I'm sorry, it's round. Um, and it is B4981. B4981. And it has 30. And the tool they gave us in this one is, for this big a picture, it is a, well, they've covered it up. Let me see. I have to get it back on it. It's a 40 by 50. And that big a picture, it's, it, and it's still kind of fuzzy, you know. It was, it, that's the way the painting must have been that they got this from. This little teeny tiny piece of wax ain't going to cut it, folks. It just ain't going to cut it. If this was your first diamond painting and you ordered this one at this size, that is not, not going to cut it. You're not going to be able to do that whole picture. You're going to have to get some wax, order somewhere, whatever. Or just if, if you find yourself running out of wax, it's your first diamond painting or whatever, and you've run out of wax, Go to the hobby store or Walmart and get the blue tack or the poster tack um, gummy stuff that you you need. You need it back. I don't mean you need it. Need need it. You K N E A D or K N E E D need. I think it's the E A, but you you just squish it. To make it sticky again and it cleans it okay it's sort of like the needable erasers that artists use you you just mess around with it but it's not sticky the uh the poster tag is for to hang posters on the wall and not not the 3m uh hanger things poster tag it'll it'll either say blue tag you can get it on amazon order blue blue tag or poster tag and it'll come in like the square stuff and you just pull out a little and um, warm it up by, by pulling it and all. And you push the point of your pen just like you do with the wax down in that until it fills it up and you can pick up your diamonds. It lasts longer. It, it just lasts longer. You could wheel it to somebody probably. You wouldn't, you wouldn't use that whole pack up in 45 years, I don't think. Anyways, but that little bitty piece of wax, that's, that's just not going to cut it, youngins. So, you may need blue, blue tack. I get blue tack anyways. I don't fool with the pink. The pink comes off on the, on the, can leave little pink, little pieces everywhere. And the tack can too, but it's a little easier to pick up if you, if that happens. You can just stick your, uh, tool on it and grab it. Now, here we go. Let me turn it around for you. So you can see it. 
So I'm going to turn it sideways so I can check the, the glue on it. It does have that same amount of wonderful, wonderful uh, glitter in the canvas. What in the world is under there? The kids have been playing in my room. And I have stuff all underneath, underneath my desk. <laughs> so anyways, we have some static. My hair is wanting to get in. And the only thing I see is the shipping wrinkles. There's nothing major in. There's no rivers or anything like that. It's sticky. Looks good. This will look so much better once you get those diamonds back on on there. Not back on there. They ain't on there yet. They haven't been on there. So, wrong choice of words. <laughs> so, really nice Christmas one. And I probably left wrinkles. You know, sometimes it's harder to put it back on there than when it came. You know, the if you've watched several videos of mine, you know I'd probably say the same thing on each one about the same things. And I'm sorry, I don't, I don't mean to bore you, but you know, there's other people that tune in that may are just starting out. And I'm trying to get these bubbles out. You can see these bubbles. I'm trying to work them to the edge. To get them out it's better for the canvas glue to not have any bubbles in there you don't want your glue drying out or anything like that which i haven't experienced any doing so i've i have had some that some diamond paintings that the glue was spotty in places that didn't have any glue and i hate finding those places i hate that Yeah, it looks good, other than just having that where it was uh, folded in shipping. That's the only thing that I see in just working that working sun. most of those out of there. There's bubbles. Anyways, there you go. We have 30 colors in this one, and it's going to be really pretty. And I'm going to try to get a variety of glow-in-the-dark to, to put where the lights would be on here. Maybe some for the eye shrink. Maybe have uh, blue, get some different blues and things to put on the eye shrink. And the eye shrink will glow, the tree will glow, this will glow, and some of the lights. I think that would be really neat. So you can customize. You don't have to always go by this. You can customize it. The only thing is you have to guess how many you're going to need. Okay? So if you want to do a certain color like this light blue only, um, then you could try counting it. Or, or you could call or you could message the company and ask them if they could send you uh, an inventory sheet on how many of each color or just ask them how many um, of a certain symbol on this picture. They may be able to tell you that. So, but I don't know. You can always try these things. I always just order a whole bunch. And if I have a lot left over, then that's great because I can use them on something else. They're not very expensive, so. Anyways, so we're looking for 30, 30 colors, and I knew there would be two. Okay, here we go. And this goes 22 to 30, so this is the, I always end up going backwards, don't I? And we've got, you can see the colors that we have in here. I'm turning them towards the light so you can see them a little bit better. It's, at night time it's a little bit harder to show y'all the accurate colors. So 
So mainly just dust like the other one. And this is 20, and this over here is one. So I'm going to turn it around so you can see. And there's a burgundy wine color. It's about the same colors as that other one that um, I just showed you. And I'm making sure that each pack has diamonds in it. Because I have went through these and one pack would be empty. Now there is a hitchhiker in there. Only one. So it's not too bad. I know I'm kind of going through these pretty quickly. I'm sorry. So you can see them. You can see each one is in there. And you trust these companies to put have the, the correct amount, you know. And you can kind of see how, how it wants to fold by sitting it up on its edge like this. I may not get it exact, but it's good enough, I think. Oh, and make sure that you put this out where you can see it. And yeah, I did. I got them too, a little too long for it, I think. Let's see. Yep, too long. So, let's go back and see what we did wrong. Okay, let's see. I think it would be... Sometimes they, it can be like trying to refold a map. Sometimes it doesn't want to go back the way it did. I'm probably the same, it's probably the same thing. And I hope that's not a, anything broke. I thought I saw something running by. <laughs> I did the same thing. <laughs> It's okay, everyone. It's okay. It'll be all right. We'll get it to fit. We'll just push it until it fits. There we go. And it fits. There we go. It's just a little bit different right there. That's okay. I hope y'all like the fact that I do let you... I, I go down here now to show you the canvas when I'm checking um, checking the canvas out and stuff instead of doing it and then holding it up for you and, and everything. I hope that you like that better. Sometimes it bothers me because all you see is somebody's hands and they're talking and that's all you see is hands. Um, it, it does kind of freak me out a little bit. I don't know. I'm, I'm a nut. So don't even go by me but <laughs> I'm like, I want to see who's talking to me. You know, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Don't just, just do your hand. It's okay if that, if that's your comfort zone. That's fine. That's fine. So I just, you know, I kind of mix it together. All right. This next one is really cute. This must have come from somewhere far away because I can't remember what. <laughs> ordering these things but I do this all the time honestly if I start getting Alzheimer's we know we know why I don't remember this anymore this is <laughs> but I love this one I love this one I do remember now ordering it this one was so cute I can't wait for you to see it here we go <laughs> Isn't that sweet? She's holding the flowers that her, I'm going to say her grandbaby girl is putting in her hair. So she's got a special hairstylist today. Do you see that? And I know Nene, who is my mom, that's what the grandbabies call her, is Nene. 
They call me Mim. And they are, <laughs> she is putting that in her curls. <laughs> and she's loving every moment of it. Isn't that the funniest thing? I love this. I love this. And I think my mama even has this kind of chair. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to switch out some of my pictures back here. You know, now everybody always asks about this one. It's no longer available at AliExpress. As far as I know, you might can find it on Ambuy. The last time I saw it, I think I saw it on Ambuy. But I get questions. This is the one I get the most questions over is where to get it. And I, it's hard for me to constantly put up, put that, you know, keep up with that. But everybody, this one is no longer available where I bought it at AliExpress. And this is available maybe at Amba, but you're just going to have to go through their hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of them. Maybe do just the people category or something like that, or the little girl or girl category, and you may very well find it. So if you do, post the link below so that way someone will that has been that maybe what to comment and ask where to get this before they've watched this. Comment under there and help me out because so, I get asked this all the time and it's because she's so pretty and everything's so nice um, And she's dreaming. She's been reading a book and she's dream. She's fell asleep and She's dreaming about being in this book this little book Whatever it is that she has read about it looks like Pocahontas and John Smith. Maybe could be anything so Anyways getting back to grandma why do I think of lemons? You know, a lot of you are decorating with lemons. Now, lemons in your kitchen and everything. This would be a great addition to it. It don't scream lemons, but it matches the colors. It's a lemon colored yellow and, and greens and stuff in there. It's really pretty. Okay, now it is number, I mean, NH658 40 by 50. Uh, here is the diamonds that come with it. NH658. You can see there on there that it is on the numbers. Look how e look how good that's packed. I mean that is solid. I just love it. I love new new diamond paintings. There's grandma. We are a little wrinkly. Not, not to say you're wrinkly, Grandma, no. This is the canvas. It's not you. You're aging just so well. Okay. Now, we have 23 colors in this picture. 40 by 50. I love it. It's going to look really good when it gets done. It's going to look really good. Now, for some reason, it was sticking kind of funny here. Didn't want to release. Um, it, that little area may have had a hard time drying when they put the, the, this is supposed to cool. The glue is hot when they put it on there and they let it cool before they put this on. If they put this on before that glue is cool, you will have all kinds of wrinkles and crazy stuff in the glue shapes and it, it'll be misshapen and that will show. You cannot get that out. You will have to see now it's sticking again here, and I'm having to have I'm having to pull it. Okay, see there. Now let me look at that really close. Yeah, that that spot. I can feel some of the glue on here, and it's still sticky though. But there's probably some little areas that's going to give me a little trouble when I do the diamond painting. So be very careful that whenever you have spots that just don't want to peel as easy as some of the ones that you've seen me do before, make sure that does not fold the wrong way or we'll, we'll really be in trouble. Okay. And so we've got a big air bottle right here. Let's push this out here. 
There we go. We Sometimes it's real easy to push the air bubbles out. You don't have to always just re, re-stick it or anything. And you can see how that helps flatten this out. And I do, I made a wrinkle here. Yeah, this glue is wanting, they may have put the top on wrong. I hope not. So, so we're gel gently, I always be gel delicate. I get in a hurry. Gentle with it. Checking this glue out. There is that shimmer. Um, it looks slick pretty pretty much for the most part. I can't get my light to shine a certain way. That's the problem that I'm having. So I can see the glare. The glare on the surface helps me to see if there's any issues. Those spots that was not peeling good um, looked a little more rough. It wasn't slick like water. Ooh, let's not stick it to the table which I'm famous for. So, let's see if I'll do better on this side when I do that. And it's sort of like when you're putting a, a decal on the wall or on your car, you sort of just want to go as it goes. Okay, now, oh, there's a big old air pocket right there. And we're going to push it out. Well, I thought I would, but it's just too far in, I think. And yep, it's not wanting to peel good on this top. And that makes me worry. It makes me worry. Because I want this one to turn out. Because it's really a favorite. Really want it. How come is it the ones that you love the absolutely most... There'll be some problem with it or something. <sighs> Just this way of this world. Way it goes. But it's okay. We'll still enjoy looking at it as we do it. Whether it comes out or not. Look at there. It's so cute. Thir 23. And they are still the letters. And they do have the DP number. So it's exactly the same as the other ones. Um... This is what was in this one. The one before had um, actual uh, baggies. Okay, let's open these up. I can figure out where the, it is. Get my hang of it. 23. Then we'll, before I get that, I want to let you look at the canvas up close and you can see it's going to be lovely and here's the grid I mean the the key is what you call it to the the symbols for the colors you see that's all letters okay Now this is to 20. Okay. And this is one. One right here. And you can see the pretty, pretty colors. And that's just a yummy yellow. Oh my gosh. What a yummy yellow. And this is more of a butter, I mean, more of a buttery, buttery orange yellow light, light, creamier, buttery but yellow, and I'm telling you, I'm loving all the colors here. This is gonna, this is a favorite. I don't think I will have to change anything on this glowing, unless I wanted her hair to glow at night. <laughs> Maybe the flowers, that would be pretty. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. Maybe. Just maybe. 
And here is 20 through 23. And this is a cream color or an eggshell. And then a light yellow. A little bit darker. Or maybe it's the same one. Let's see. Well, it doesn't have the color here. Let's see. 25 and 22. Wait. 22 and 20. Let's see. 20. Wait a minute. It's all three of them. 22. Yeah. They're all the same. Number 22, number 22, number 22. So these are all the same. It means it had a lot of these. Okay, it had to have three packs. And then there's the green. And number 20 is a gray-blue. Blue-gray. Whatever you want to call it. I think Mama would say blue-gray. Just know my mom. She likes grays. She likes to stain our porch in grays. Okay, now see, now that doesn't look like it's right. Let's see here. I'm probably getting too big. That's too big for the page. I mean the envelope. Yep. See, I made a mistake somewhere. It's right here. Let's see that mistake right there. Let's see that goes around something. Let's see. I am not getting this right. No. We shall, though. We shall. <laughs> Just maybe. Well, I'll get it on there the way I want to. Whether it's like they did it or not. Let me put that there. It's gonna go. We might not, I'm not as good as them people do this every day. Factory workers. <laughs> okay. There we go. I got it in there. <laughs> and I have the numbers viewable. viewable. Okay, everyone. That's it for the first three of that package that I had showed you that I opened. And again, the company is right here that I got them from, and it'll be in the description down below. Please let me know which one you like and what I can do better that y'all would like to see me do. Um, you know, um, I have uh, have a lot of ideas, and I get so busy. Oh, I'm so sleepy. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching and taking time out of your day to let me be in it. And it, I really, really appreciate it. Thank you so very much for being my subscribers. If you haven't subscribed yet and you like seeing new diamond paintings and crafts and things and just crazy things on my page, on my channel, please hit like and subscribe if you don't mind. I really, really appreciate you for doing that. It helps all the other people like you find uh, me, my channel, and it helps YouTube to know who to show and suggest my channel to others that, you know, would like like to see some crafting and or, or you know, diamond painting and and are just are new into it and they would like to see it you help that person find me find the ones you like not only just my channel but all the other um, crafting channels that you um, hit like and subscribe to you're helping all these other people find really good channels if you like it then others will like it too and it helps us to stay producing videos. If people don't watch us anymore, well, 
why would we want to do it? Uh, you know, I want to be a part of people's lives and and share happiness and 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 things like that. And I hope that um, others will get to see it. If um, if I'm just awful, I'm so sleepy. I'm so sorry. Anyways, if I'm awful, I sure don't want to be doing awful videos. So if it's good, hit like. If it's bad, hit hit the thumbs down. But I love y'all and I appreciate everything y'all do. I appreciate y'all for thinking about me and a lot of you let me know that you're praying for me and my family and that is just precious. That is the best gift anybody can give anybody. I'd rather have that than anything else. I'd rather have that than a million billion dollars. Seriously. Because a million billion dollars can't hug you around the neck. Around, it, it, it can't, it get, it can't. People say, oh, it can comfort you. Well, no. My Lord comforts me and helps me get through the day. And your prayers, he hears them and he does help me. And I want to thank you so very much for it. From the bottom of my heart. And I hope to see you in the next video where I share the other three that came in the same package that you saw at the first of the video. <laughs> it would take me three hours probably to get all of them done. But thank you so much. I know I keep saying that. God bless you, each and every one of you. Bye.